Hello and welcome to another video. What I have right here is the Pentacon Fagen 3 LSL in Stormworks. This is the exterior right here. Look at that. Now there are only two ways of getting to the tank. You can either hop on to the exhaust port right here, or you can grab this handle up here. The hatches right here do not open due to the storage bin right here. And if you recognize the hull, it's the same hull I used for the Stug 3, because they use the same hull. So climb on top of the turret, you can open the commander's hatch right here, and hop in. Inside you have the breach in front, machine gun there, and the turret controls there. You have two hatches either side, which will allow you to look out. You can't actually get in or out of them, since they're a bit small, but they're just basically for decoration anyways. In the gunner seat, you have the traverse controls and the elevation controls. So you can move the gun up and down. And then use the traverse controls to turn the turret. Moving down the door into the hull. Or actually, I forgot about this one. You can turn on the interior lighting using that circuit breaker. Right here is the extend radio antenna, so that antenna that's outside, you can extend it so it will be facing upwards instead of to the side. Like that. Which I'm going to keep that on. Down here you have the transmission, fire extinguisher, and the ammo bin bins. The ammo bins that are in green. Then you have a shelf here with some medical supplies and other supplies. You have an ammo dump here to put your empty shells. Right here is the radio operator seat. He has a fake radio and a viewport to look out of. There's an escape hatch here, which again you cannot get out of, but you can't open it. Moving into the driver's seat, the driver has controlled the front lights. To the right is all the gear controls and the starter. Then you want to engage gear 1 and do all these as needed. Max RPM is about 1300. If you wanted to go into reverse, you could do that. Max speed is about 25 kilometers per hour. You can turn left and right using these buttons right here. This is what the tank looks at looks like at night. I think it looks pretty cool. But that's all subjective. So 
So that should be it for this tank. I'll see you all in the next video.